lose the battle for the bloodline, and you're on nature's garbage pile. A no-holds-barred fight between red kangaroos is never far away. Males train as kickboxers from an early age. A fearsome claw on their hind legs can disembowel dogs and humans. Winners mate. Losers are exiled to the outskirts of the mob. The red kangaroo can cover over 25 feet in a single bound. And they use the same muscles to fight. Rusty is a six-year-old battle-hardened bruiser. He wants to take over a mob, but first, must whack this guy. <laughs> no moves are out of bounds. Short front legs wield sharp claws. They can hold an opponent close in a fight. wise guy leans on his tail to unload both barrels. The red kangaroo's tail is strong enough to support its body weight of nearly 200 pounds, half of which is pure muscle. And 44% of that is in their upper hind legs. The muscles here are attached to bone with strong elastic tendons. These enhance the power of the kangaroo's leap and its kick. The male's skin is up to twice as thick across their abdomen to protect them from an opponent's feet. Kangaroos can even retract their testicles to guard against low blows. Now Rusty, younger and fitter, kicks back. Females don't care who wins. They just want a strong male. But it's everything to Rusty. Male red kangaroos never stop growing. As they get bigger, they become more dominant until they challenge for the top spot. The older wise guy's bigger and stronger, but Rusty thinks he has what it takes. Rusty gets a powerful kick. If he loses, his chances of mating look slim. His opponent's on the ropes. Sometimes it's not the big hits that decide the fight. A sly uppercut fells the wise guy. Another punch sends him packing. <laughs> <laughs> 